Uh, not on the agenda is um, we, we will have for our next meeting an appointment that we will have for the library board. Actually, I think uh, at least a couple for the library board. We do have some folks that are here to represent the library board. Uh, Ms. Kelly Lentz, would you please come forward? Um, thank you for um, hearing me this morning. It's good to see all of you. Um, I believe we have two um, nominees here for appointment to the library board to fill two vacant positions. Um, Mr. Jack Hartley, Mrs. Linda Mose, and Mr. Matt Lawrence. Okay. Uh, would any of them like to come forward, please? Mr. Hartley? How are you doing? Good. I'm Jack Hartley. I've been a business owner here in Lowndes County for 17 years, owner of U.S. Photo and also a company called Homestead Senior Care. Um, I would be happy to serve on the board. Uh, I have quite a bit of extensive sales marketing management experience. I think I can bring that to the, the board and uh, be a, a, a real good player. Okay. Do we have any questions for Mr. Hartley? All right. Thank you, sir. Next. State your name, please. Good morning. I'm Linda Most. Um, I'm an assistant professor of library and information studies at VSU. I moved to Valdosta to take the position and I will be here five years. I'm an experienced public librarian. Before I went back to get my graduate degree in earn my PhD, I worked as a public librarian in Palm Beach County, Florida and Baltimore, Maryland. And my dissertation research was on the role of rural public libraries as important community places. I think SGRL is a very important institution to this county, and I'd like very much to be involved in um, seeing it prosper. Okay. Any questions for Ms. Most? Okay. Thank, Thank you, you. Thank, Thank you for hearing me. Absolutely. State your name, please. I'm Matt Lawrence. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I'm a lawyer here in town. And I will not, I promise you, I won't try to give advice to the library board. Um, two reasons that I think that, or that I'd like to serve. First of all, this is just a very simple one. My family's been here since there's been a lounge county. And I think that it is incumbent on uh, people who are nurtured by a community to give back to that community. And I feel like I've got a duty to serve in some sort of capacity. And I'd be glad to do that for the second reason. And that's because I think that um, in an era where each of you have these computers and all in front of you, these techno technological gadgets, which they're all nice and they help us in a lot of ways, um, it is extraordinarily important to be able to sit down and read through a book, comprehend and understand it, and have the, the way that we think shaped by what we use as tools to learn. And our culture, our uh, Western civilization, since the printing press was invented, has been developed and created by the written word. And I think that it's very important that we should encourage children to not only drudge through what they have to drudge through in school, but to in inculcate in them a desire and a love of reading for its own sake and, not, and pursuing knowledge for its own.